Okay, hey guys, what's up? So today, I know I'm in my kitchen and I'm not doing TikTok hacks. I'm just doing some life hacks, back to school life to hacks. But before I get started with this video, do not use any of these. These are just fun party tricks. You should not cheat on any tests or any quizzes or lie to your parents or anything like that. Do not do these. If you get in trouble, you cannot blame me because I told you not to do them. Okay, so for our first one, it's actually quite cool. Like, they're cool and all, but don't do them. <laughs> okay, so here, let's tilt down my paper. Okay, let's see. Here, I won't write backwards. Okay, so let's say you got a D minus on a test, okay? Uh, see that? Got a D minus, which, guys, if, you, if you're getting D minuses on tests, you need to study more. Okay, so, and then here's the trick. Okay, so you do that, make it a plus. Okay, and then you do that, and it's an A. Plus, but like I said, do not do this. This is just like cool, fun trick, party thing, show your friends. But yeah, don't do them, okay? Because that's, that's dishonest. I wish I had like a vlogging camera. Okay, but anyway, so just put that in a little box. We'll get started with the next one. Okay, so for the next, next one, is again you guys need to study more if you're getting C minuses on test. So you do C minus, okay? And what you're gonna do, you're gonna put a line through the minus, and then you ready? You're gonna make that C into like you know like the circle teachers sometimes do around it, and then you're gonna make an A inside of that. Fast. Or, you know, if you want to be a uh, less of a liar, which you guys shouldn't be doing these hacks anyway, they're just like cool little tricks. You could not make it an A plus, you could make it more realistic and get an A minus, which you know would be better than an A plus, but still not great. Okay. And then if you're things like you know, sometimes they write like late on your paper, then what you're gonna do. So I wrote late. Okay, hold on one sec. Okay, you're gonna make the L into like a D. Date. So it's, it says date, and then you're gonna do like a colon and put a question mark. Okay? And then, hold on. Okay, here's if you have an F. I'm pretty sure all of you guys know this trick. It's been pretty popular. F, okay. And then you make it into an A like that. And then you just add the line through to make it an A plus. And then if you want, you can circle it, but... I'm not going to circle it, just because, so let me go get the supplies for the next one. So for this next hack, I'm going to be using Sawyer as a student, and it says, like, this is how, like, you take notes, which this one isn't really cheating, it is kind of a good hack, but what you're going to do is you're going to make sure you're on Google Chrome or all that, any Google thing, and then you're going to push <laughs> And then you're gonna type in Google Docs, okay? This is just saving you some Sawyer. So Ooh, me the butter. Sawyer. So okay, and then once you're at Google Docs, you're going to click, I don't know how to share my screen on the camera, so I can't like, you know, like how some YouTubers like pop up when they're looking at on the side of the screen. You're gonna click on Google Docs, not Gmail for Business, that might show up. You're gonna click on just Google Docs. It should be in blue or for purple. And then once you click on that, you're gonna go to um, blank document. And then 
you're gonna you can title it at the top notes for um, uh, let's do history okay and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to tools push voice typing and then you're gonna click uh, click to speak once your teacher starts typing so for this next one I'm gonna act like I'm the teacher because so here he left <laughs> Uh, because he wanted to go play, but let me go get like a fake paper board to put up there. Okay. okay, class. So for today, we will be talking about Benjamin Franklin. Okay, so. Here's where the hacking comes in, guys. I'm about to talk about some information about him, and so you just click, click to speak on the voice thing. Okay, class. So, who knows who Benjamin Franklin is? Ah, yes. Toby? Benjamin Franklin invented the electricity. Yes, he, um, he made electricity, well electricity is today, so we know more about it. Remember, he did the, um, like the key thing. Oh, let me just draw a key for you guys. With the kite, he had like, in the book that I read a few years ago, he had a red diamond shaped kite. And he attached the key, okay? to see if metal would react to electricity. Because every time that he tried to get into his house with the, you know, little doorknob and his key, it shocked him. So he wanted to know if key would react to electricity. Well, that was only on rainy days that um, that happened. So he took his kite and his key, he attached the key to the bottom of the kite strip. And during a thunderstorm, he took it outside, so you know where the clouds are, but they were thundery because it was uh, like it was like about to rain. Oh, this is hard. Oh no, my thing ran out of ink. Okay, class. One sec, I gotta go get a new uh marker. Okay, so he went outside on a rainy day, you know, and, and there were thunderstorms going on. So, he, of course, he had the key on the bottom of the cut string, and he had, um, and the key was struck by lightning. Okay, and so that's how he figured out that metal will be react to um, thunder. So, for our next one, we will be learning about math for the next hour since we finished our history period. Okay, so, do any of you know what a variable is? Do we need to the definition of a variable? No? Okay, well, that's good because we haven't gone over it. Well, I mean, it'd be nice if you knew it. But, anyway, a variable can be like X. It's normally X, or it could be Y, or A, or Z. Okay, it could be any letter, but generally it's X. Okay? And a variable is used for an unknown number. Okay, so let's do an example. Okay, so let's do x times, or no, we'll do x divided by 12 equals. Okay, um, Jessica, 
What number do you want X to be? I want it to be three, Nick. Okay, so then next down, I'm gonna do three divided by 12. Now, Jessica, do you really answer that? It's four, Miss. Good job. So four is the answer, but we used an X, and then either the question will give you information on how to figure out what X is, or you will have to make it up yourself. So she could have picked a six, a three, well she did, um, two, she could have even done 1.5 or 7.6, and we could have figured that out and no. demonstration. It was very fun to do. Okay, <laughs> so um, for next one, we are going to be doing one <clears throat> Let me go get the supplies for it. So this next hack you should especially not use because it is like very much <laughs> cheating. <laughs> okay, and so what you're gonna do is um, if you don't want to write your essay, what you're gonna do is you're gonna t uh, search essay typer. Okay. Did I search that up right? Hold on. So you're gonna go to sa typer. You could try satyper.com. Oh, that didn't search up anything better. Oh, here we go. www.satyper.com. Easy typer types your essay in minutes. Okay, you guys should not do this because it's cheating, okay? And so, um, Again, I can't share my screen, but it says, oh no, it's finally like, and I have to finish my essay. And then um, if you can choose from different topics. I'm gonna do um, radioactive body cells. And then you're gonna push like this pencil. Oh, it, it didn't have that topic. <laughs> Okay, um, let's do health and wellness. I just did an assignment on this, but, you know, I typed it by myself because I'm not a cheater. Okay, and then it comes up with, like, this cool thing, and, um, on the thing that I watched on how to do it, you just, like, basically, whoa! <laughs> okay, so I'm literally just typing a ton of keys. Oh my gosh. In So I'll push R right now and it put health. So right now it says wellness is a state beyond absence of illness, but rather aims to optimize well-being. The term wellness has also been misused for pursue health. Okay, let me, I'll be back when I have my, um, whole essay <laughs> done this should uh take like two minutes okay so i just finished and this seriously looks like an essay but if you're in like middle school or elementary school and you have one of these you should not use this website because um well you shouldn't use it to begin with but um it literally <laughs> looks like a high schooler wrote it, which I'm not, I'm just in, I'm only in seventh grade, but that was like insanely cool. Oh my goodness. Okay, <laughs> that was very cool actually, but mm, yeah, so. That was very cool. It did type my essay, though. But I'm not going to use that for school or anything because, you know, that's just how dishonest. Okay. Okay, one sec. I'll be back. Okay, guys. 
guys, so I didn't have enough time to try all the hacks I wanted, so right after this I'm going to go ahead and film a part 2, but tell me in the comments if you want a part 3, because I'm going to be doing part 2 anyway, and bye guys, see you next time.